I, I totally agree with you because I'm not stupid. People, you know, they 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 try to keep me on their team because of yes. they, think, yes. they think this man is they think this man is scared of me, so they we mm-hmm. keep him on the team. Yeah, we got some backup. I'm not dumb. I, I see that. Yeah. I see that like TV Wonder Okay, okay. Like all of the ends and out there. What's Papa Empire? Welcome back to another lit show. It is your girl AB, and I am back with another exposing the sucker. They wouldn't say the stuff if it bothered them. See why it didn't bother me? Because my baby mama got married to a dude. My son's in the house. That's her only kid. Oh, so he. Are. But it's it's a lot of like I want. I got I got kids. And I pay child support for one, and I don't see him because I don't go to force, force the issue because my kid is in another state. Now, I don't know if some of y'all heard him the first time, so we're going we gonna to rewind that back for a second time. One, I got I got kids, and I pay child support for one, and I don't see him because I don't go to force, force the issue because my kid is in another state. Okay, so basically what you guys were just listening to was a clip of yesterday's live where Psycho has stated that um he has a son out of state whom he pays child support for allegedly he says that he doesn't see the child and he doesn't push the issue now again i'm no genius or anything but isn't that the same exact reason why you're on here going so hard on crier who actually does push the issue behind his child see this is what i say you're such a big advocate for present fathers yet you backtrack on everything you know you stand for when it comes to mucker not only that you're backtracking on what you stand for you know with yourself because (laughs) it's giving very much deadbeat if you ask me child support or not just like you said all these things about mucker and creo bay just for you to get on your platform and renege every damn thing you said so much stuff you have reneged on for you to be a millionaire and all about being what's right and what's real you're not standing on what you say and that that's what i have a problem with and i think i speak for everyone when i say that also another lie we caught you in last night how the hell are you paying child support when you said the other day that all of your kids are grown you know that cryer is a good dad right nah he ain't huh you saying he's not no what okay, makes so is the, hold on, can I ask you a question? When you say that, is this part of, you know, y'all little skit going on? No, that's real. Gonna tell people we don't have a problem. We don't have don't have a don't have a problem. Have a have a problem with it. Have a problem with each other. Now, correct me if I'm wrong. This whole throughout this whole video, if I'm ever lying about anything, I need for you guys to comment down below and check me in the comments. Now, one minute it's y'all don't have a problem, and the next minute is you speaking down on this man's fatherhood. Now, I'm no genius or anything or psychic, like I say. But what grown ass man would be okay with another grown ass man talking down on their fa- What grown ass man would be cool with them and not have a problem with that? Y'all please let me know in the comment section down below because I- clearly I'm missing something. I'll tell y'all my theory on the situation and I'm gonna head out for the day. I didn't give y'all two commentary videos. But this is what I believe, y'all. Psycho and Cryer may have or maybe really do talk, you know, on the phone or here and there. Mr. Cryer did at some point talk to him about collabing. But I think one of the stipulations for Mr. Cryer was you have to stop talking down on me. Not even that. Don't come for my fatherhood. Now, honestly, I didn't even want to believe that Cryer really had a conversation with this psycho about you know collabing but you know cryer verified that a psycho just could not keep cryer's name out of his slithery snaking ass mouth and channel and cryer as he should ended that right then and there and just never spoke anything else about a collab i mean who could blame him because me if i was in a position that mr cryer was in now i would be very articulate with who i do business with and so psycho just never got you know his collab so what he did was took the route which he said on the live last night do i have to pull that up too that he just finished the 
quote unquote series out himself. And that's really what it all boils down to. This man is doing any and everything for views and the clout. This man is over there buying views. Not only that, he's creating drama and playing both sides. Clearly, we seen that last night just for the sake of clout and money and attention. Like y'all, when I tell y'all money is the root to all evil and clout is a dangerous drug be careful who you get that clout to i learned that last night but um you know you live and you learn shout out to mr cryer shout out to love by erica um you know we just gonna keep keep doing our thing and fuck the haters all y'all cock-eyed motherfuckers who watching fuck y'all